Welcome back everybody to Farming Simulator 19. Here on Ravenport, your host, Mr. Blue, aka Tommy Miller. Folks, how y'all doing? Oh, I'm doing this good. Why am I sounding like this? <laughs> I have no idea. I have no idea, folks. Uh, today, today, folks, we're going to do field 9 and 10, which are plowed together. All soybeans. And if we get time, we're going to run over here and do field 7, I believe. I think it's field 7. Uh, oops, I just hit 7. Uh, need to hit that button. <sighs> it's such a beautiful, beautiful evening. Just flying my drone, looking around. Let's, let's hit it, folks. Uh, ow, ow, ow. Ooh, ooh, cotton don't feel good. Cotton stalks. Let's get this bad boy started up, should we? Or shall we? Okay, I see it's uh, not on this one. So that's good. And y'all probably like, well, what's that on that, Mr. Blue? Well, folks, uh, I... I went ahead and installed every mod I had uh, went through Stevie's mods the updates and I got them all squared away and taken care of um, should have done that you know like a month ago but I finally got around to it and I noticed you can see my GPS is completely off Maybe if I do that. But I'm supposed to hit Alt, left Alt and R, and it's auto whiff. But for some reason, it's not working on this map. It, it's working on another map. Let's see. I need to change this to. Uh, I don't know if that's it or not. I think this is going to be it. I hope. Uh, auto whiff, no offset, and that should be it. Just gotta, oh no, it's turned the wrong way. It's turned the wrong way. It, it's just, that wasn't it. Uh, actually, uh, sorry folks. I am having tibbles, remembering what button's what. Oh, is I locked on GPS this time? I am now. I am. Still ain't quite the right width, I don't think. Or is it? I guess once I get on track, it is. But anyway, anyway. I'm just going to go down here, go across the ends, make a, a full round. And then I'm going to come back and hire a worker. Um, as you can see, 118000 That might be down a little bit on our money there. I bought some chickens. I bought some more chickens. Um, yeah. That's all I can say. Is, yeah. Uh, I have found out that one of our pins are maxed out. I already said that on the episode, but I can't remember, so... Yeah, get what you get. <laughs> Mr. Baloo's getting forgetful here lately. Just been going through a lot, folks. I'm thinking about making a video of it. Don't hold it to me. I'm thinking about doing a live stream with just me talking. Um... Yeah, I, I'm just, I need to explain a few things, but I really don't know how to do it. They're kind of personal in a way. I don't want to say all the details. You know, we got we got to hide a few secrets from each other, right? It makes it interesting. But it's, it's not bad. It's all good. It's, it's bad, but it's good. You know what I mean? It, it, it's, it's all good, but it's bad. 
I'm probably like, well, Mr. Blue, what what have you been taking? <sighs> Not really nothing, folks. But there's some things that's came up, and they've been cooking a long time before YouTube came around. Uh, just live situations, but I'm probably going to make a video on that soon. Probably within two weeks, give or take. Um, the reason why I want it to be a video and stuff of a live stream is I want to add some pictures in here and there. This is kind of like a project I'm working on. I probably shouldn't even say anything because usually when I say something, I don't finish a project. Alright, that should be enough room for him to turn around without hitting the train or anything. I am going to offset this a little bit just in case. Alright, we're going to have to <clears throat> tap through all this stuff. Close enough. We got to get our tractor going. Eh, if I can fit through here. Oh, that muscle mine can get you in trouble sometimes. Uh, let's see, other than the the chickens, uh, this field plant, no, this field is not planted so good, I'm not hurting the neighbor's crops. I, I'm trying to think, it's been like a week and a half since I've been on Ravenport. Uh, filled one up top with the grass. I did mow it, so it's done. And I think I'm going to take some tethers up there and dry that grass out and just turn it to hay. Because our horses, are, we're going to be getting low on hay here soon, so we're going to have to do something. And I'm looking for buying the field two and three up there. Uh, you going to stop, right? Yeah, there you go. And just unload all that precious soybeans in this buggy so we can go sell them, hopefully. And while he's unloading, let's take a look. Alright, soybeans, uh, well, take a look at the eggs, folks. Eggs is thirty-five seventy-four. Oh, I wish that would turn to a great demand or something, or or this other one would pass that price. But to go on over here, and that's great demand for sugar beets at the restaurant. Soybeans is sixteen hundred and fallen, but I think the ranch will probably pass that. But I'm wanting pork grain elevator, but it's going back down. But, you know, right now, ranch is the highest, or fixing be the highest. Ooh, what was that? Oh, wage payment. I thought something was up. All right, uh, we're going to tab through again. Uh, truck's facing this way because we've been taking them right over there and storing them. So we can get that train. But there's our grass. And there's our hay over there. See how small it's getting now? We got to feed the horses. Um, here's our wool. But right now, you've seen the prices was down. And we got two more pallets over there percolating. Which I don't think Bill will put on this. If anybody out there is watching my channel at all that can help me out. I'm looking for a truck like this. But is a auto load. Because this truck would be perfect for doing the missions and stuff. You just pull up there and it auto loads pallets. Still working on those seeds. Um, like I said, I've redone the Stevie mods. You know, he had updates to a lot of them. And uh, we still got them. Uh, he said the best thing to do is delete them. Uh, your mods folder and then add the new ones in. 
I don't see none missing. The only thing that's missing is the big water tanker we had. And, uh, I don't know. We, we got other tankers. And this guy here is done down here putting out poop. So we're going to be going to field 23 with him. Uh, the truck has probably a one eighth of a uh, probably enough to fill me up about ten thousand. Probably not even that much. Probably five thousand liters in it. And we need to get down here and mow our horses. Horses and animals are growing up. We gotta find a small mower or something. I know I was going to switch this tractor out for the one that's on the grain buggy, but this tractor really needs to be on this too, because this is quite a load. The sheeps are running to one side like, oh, now he's fixing to spray us with poop. I wouldn't do that on purpose, sheeps. My meepers. Man, yeah. Although I am getting kind of close to your water. But just in case some of y'all are turning in and they ain't seen that one episode, I had to get rid of the Raptor because of bug issues with it or mod conflict with something somewhere. It might not have been the Raptor itself. This might be some of the mods I got. That's why... When you got almost 500 mods, somewhere, somehow, one or two of them is going to be fighting each other for some reason. And as you can see, I, I just now realize, oh, there's a pole there. <laughs> that, that, that wasn't the part of what I was fixing to say. I was looking up at the top of my screen on the right side and the left side. I got two inspector mods going. I shouldn't have that. Alright, something's telling me to go check on our combine. Um, even the conveyor belt's still there. I'm just wondering. Because I deleted the old one out of the map. I mean, out of the mods folder first. And put the new one in, the updated one in. So, I don't know. Um, we emptied out the straw out of that to here because these horses needed some straw. I This ceiling's so low, I don't have nothing to fit in there except for the shredder. And it's just hard, folks. It's hard to get anything in there. Alright. Don't tell me I'm going to tap all the way back around. Here we go. I'm going to try to catch him on the way back down. This way, so it'll be on the right side. But, uh, one, two, that'll be his third round, and we're getting pretty good. Uh, also... I think on last week, the last weekend's episode, I talked about getting some cows. Because uh, Christy Nicola was wanting, uh, said she needed some milk, go along with the, I think it's the eggs that I sold. Something like that. You have to go back and watch last week's episode. But uh, I'm thinking about leveling that hilltop out um i don't know there or up by field three but i want to get some cows on this map we don't have no cows or pigs we got sheep chickens and horses so yeah um might not be no changes right away but as soon as we sell our horses that's almost, or, or will be, around four hundred thousand dollars. 
And we're going to make some changes in for sure. Whoa! Alright, what happened to you? Red fire. I want to back up here. Oh! GBS got offline there. I don't know why he stopped, but I might have been in the way or something. But while that's doing that, let's go look at our nothing good on the contracts. Um, the sheets are at 33. But this, this pen here is maxed out. That's why it don't have no numbers right here. And as you can see, we got 58, 59, 59, 62, 63. And then we got our horses, they're getting low on hay and water. We're going to have to buy a tanker. Um, the boxing down here, they're really needing some hay. So, uh, oh. It's done finally. We're really going to have to do some animal care uh, as soon as we get done with these soybeans. So, speaking of, I'm going to finish up this field some and get started in the other field. I'll bring y'all back then. Um, just kind of see where our totals are and stuff like that. Um, because I don't want to make this too long. It's already about 17, 18 minutes. So, yeah. Uh, let's see. Let's go this way. We already got a little bit in the semi truck. And that was from, uh, 14 through 17. Let me get up here real quick and I'll show y'all. And we just been taking them to there. We ain't been selling them yet. We've just been putting them in the storage. So we know uh, how many we got. And we get a great demand for soybeans. Or the highest price. We'll probably go sell some. Alright. It didn't fill the first hopper up. So we still got... Let's see. It's a hern... Over 150,000. Each trailer is 100,000, so we got about 150,000 liters of room left. So, got plenty of room. But, folks, I'll be back in just a little bit. I'm going to let him do some more thrashing. Or, well, it's Betty. Betty's on the combine. Okay. But anyway, I'll be back in a second. All right, folks. I was, huh, uh, I was going to try to get finished with the field. I got to that much, and you see the combine sitting there. We got a problem with the combine. Oh, it's it's not major. It just ran out of fuel. Completely ran out of fuel. And as you can see on this tractor here, try to get it weird. And the bottom right corner at the fuel gauge, you'll see some blue writing. And what that is, you might see it better right there. It's a little blue symbol of a fuel gauge. And it says death, 97%. Alright, well, we got death now. I forgot I activated all mods. So that might be a problem coming soon I, I gotta get the pump in the ground and stuff so uh yeah but anyway our combine don't have death or at least it's not showing up right now but as you can see refuel vehicle i'm completely out of fuel completely out now it's so close I don't know if we got a fuel vehicle or not. Um, we got the tank here. 
And that right there. Hey! I don't know if it's active. Probably not because it's not a thing on the thing there. So let me get this over to the combine. I'm going to try it. I'm going to stop by the fuel station first. Or gas station. Y you know what I mean. Actually, we got a thing right down there. I forgot about that. All right, folks. Uh, I I'm going to take a shortcut. Let me see if I can put some fuel in this, and uh, I'll be back in a second. All right. I, I tried to put fuel in it. it. It wouldn't let me. So I doubt this is going to work. But we're going to pull up right here and find out. <sighs> yeah. Well, come on. There we go. Uh, no, it, it's not going to work. Okay. Well, I'm I want to have to go get a a, a tank. I'll go get a fuel tank, folks. So I'll, I'll be right back again. A little bit for me, but just a second for y'all. Well, I thought I had one. I drove right past it. I guess the trailer was hiding it. But we got a fuel trailer. And I think this uh, repairs vehicles too. Uh, and it's loaded. All right. All right. Uh, let's see here. We got to. Uh... There we go. It's going now. Oh, okay. Got the trigger. Good. I wish it would actually show us, uh, putting the nozzle in but that would probably be rough for all the vehicles let's see refuel harvester um oh okay it's refueling slow but it's refueling all right i'm gonna stop about right there And let's see, put the pipe in. I'm going to get this bad boy back going. The reason I stopped there, I, I want to make sure we don't waste any fuel because we may be trading this off after harvest. Maybe. We don't know for sure. We'll probably keep it and do mission contracts with it. Oh, oh there we go. Oh, got to shut the pump off. Don't want it running out of fuel. There we go. And if you come around back here, you can, uh... Oh. Let's see. Activate service function. It raises up. And voila, I got a light. And instead of it being back here, it's to the side right here also. But I, I like this. Uh, there's also a van out there and a, and a big record truck and just a little bit of everything. But we didn't, about a quarter of the tank, that's all we put in the combine. And it put the combine, what, about three quarters? So not bad. At least now we run out of fuel. We, <laughs> we know what happened. I, I need this trailer on the. Uh, uh, new Woodshire and uh, just in case y'all don't uh, haven't seen that yet folks uh, just going over and uh, go to my channel and just go to playlists and you'll see my new Woodshire uh, thing about starting Mercury Farms um, just don't know how I'm going to play it quite yet There's our other mower. I was wondering where it was at. Got stuff scattered everywhere. Which, that's good, though. 
Right, I'm just going to park right here. Um, so far, we have 140,709 liters. Um, and plus whatever's left right here. But uh, I'm going to be back in a little bit, folks. I'm going to get the grand total if nothing else goes wrong. Um, probably just we're going to go dump it in that silo over there, uh, over there, and give you the grand total. So I'll be right back. All right, folks, we are uh, wrapping up our last bit here. We're just pretty much waiting on the combine. It's so slow, so slow. If I can get through here. But the combine's almost done. Just about, just about. And there it goes. And looks like I'm empty too. So, we're going to get the grand whopping total here in just a second. Get out of the way here. Now, I hope y'all can't hear the noise in the background. I got the AC running. It's pretty warm today in here. I got up to about 78, 80 degrees, somewhere in there. I'm like, oh, no, I can't, can't do it. Got, got to turn our air on. The way the sinuses and the pollen and all that stuff is, it's just rough right now. So I got, I got to have it on, so. It's not really registering that much on the mic, so I think it'd be all right. If anything, it will just drown out the game volume because I know it won't drown out my mouth. My mouth's so big and loud. Woo! <laughs> but folks, we're almost there. We got a hundred seventy thousand seven hundred seventy-one liters off of those. Well, it's basically three fields, but two. All right. And here we go. It's pretty easy to get into. Let's see. We've got to make sure I'm on the front. We're going to open the cover. So we're going to open the cover. There we go. All right. What's what's going on? Rolling backwards instead of going forwards. Am I spinning? I am spinning. There we go. <laughs> kind of like real life. Oh, come on now. There we go. Uh, what? I'm on the front. Am I not going to get a symbol? Why am I not getting a symbol to dump? I, I have no idea, folks. And I'm not even getting a symbol on the back either. Are we full? We shouldn't be full. Uh, let's go on over to beans. Um, we got 200,000 in there and it holds 400,000. Oh, well, there is 200,000, right? Yes, it's 200,000 and it holds 400,000. So 200,000 plus uh, it'll be 370,771 liters. 370,000 folks. Soybeans. But I just. 
I didn't want that. Wrong, wrong button. Open cover. Maybe I need to restart my game or something. I, I have been playing for a little while and it seems like here lately I, I do have a mod that messes up some. I, I think it's the teleport mod. Because if you use it one time and play for a while, let's see, get it back on the front. And let me do this too. Uh, detach that. Nope, still no icon. Well, folks, we got 370,000 liters that's going to be in this silo. Um, right now, port grain elevator is the lease. Uh, ranch is the highest and it's going up so we may take 200,000 liters to ranch and then wait and see what's the highest price after that you know we might have to take some to a restaurant uh, and just divide it. I was wanting to use a train but I'm not selling at that price when we can get this price <clears throat> excuse me um, yeah, we're just going to have to ride through it, store it for a little bit. We'll make it. But, uh, let's see here. Next episode, we're going to be dealing with the animals because they need some TLC badly. And hopefully our wool prices will be up. Because we really need to go sell them. We need our pallets. Some of these going to disappear and some won't. Uh, there was something else I was going to show you. Uh. He just done around the, that end, come across and down this end. Uh, Got to finish him up. Uh, took the truck to go get some digest state. Uh, one thing I was going to show you is, I, I think I done showed it already, but I just want to do it one more time. There it goes, Instagram. But what I'm going to do is when, I ain't going to show it right now. I, I'll show it makes that episode when we do animals but like this one gets almost full like it likes a pallet or two we can go ahead and set a new one there and take this one on down and take some of the others and like that pallet down there and put on top of this and then refill it now, that's what i've been doing um what i want is my semi truck and I, I brought this up here it's fixing to pick up grass come on folks I'm recording but I was going to pick this up and I got thinking I need this tethered I, I got to ted this and let it dry out so I can have hay so I was about to make a boo boo here we go oh my goodness right, I want to pull up here you can see right there it says digest eight. And I can pull right there and digest it again. What I done, they had an update to the slurry trading system or whatever it's called. You know, here a while back, I put. <clears throat> ah. I put this in here down, which I'm going to go ahead and leave this one. It's for slurry. Like when we do get cows and we get filled up or the price is not good. And uh, we need somewhere to put it. We can put up to, I think, 250,000 liters in this. But these here, like if we're doing uh, the BGA with uh, the silage selling it and stuff, when we get maxed out on our BGA for digestate, it's 500,000 liters right here between these two. Or 250,000 each. So what I'm going to do... And I, I totally made a boo-boo because I thought the pump had to be on the back side where you can come in here and dump here. But I was wrong. That up there is right where it be on this side. But this in here 
he got to be over here. So that really worked out. So we can just drive along on the other side of the fence there. Like I was just doing. Excuse me. Sorry, folks. I'm, the sinuses are killing me. But I have 100,000 liters in here. I'm going to fill up this first one. Maybe this in here, hopefully. I went too far back. There we go. Stop. Stop. Uh, it's going to take a little bit to unload. But you can see right there, the numbers are going down. So we got a place to put our digest state now, folks, until we need to go sell it. or well, Actually, we're going to be using it for fertilize. Um, the first stage fertilize, we'll be putting slurry down every time, like after we, before we plow or something like that. Or before we cultivate, we'll put digestate down and go from there. And that will help save us a lot of money. So I can, I can, pre I'm pretty much just going to keep doing this. Go over here, fill up, and bring it back over here. Um, because probably five or six episodes from now we're going to do another big grass haul and just filling up our bunkers and getting us some more money you know that's a good way to do money money but we'll have to plant some grass fields so probably we're probably going to do corn this uh chaff corn well almost missed it I don't know how I did that without hitting anything. All right, come on, scoot over. There we go. 700,000 left. All right, folks, that's uh, pretty much all I had to show you. So uh, we're basically right now just waiting for these prices to, to go up. Uh, we're going to wait to that and stop and see what it is. And see what they look like and also we're watching this wool price and egg price uh oh wait egg, eggs here's the eggs i i need to go ahead and sell them i guess that is a pretty good price i'm just wondering if some of these are going to go up i hate to not do it i guess if i start seeing this and go down and now i'm on probably sell Excuse me again. But anyway, that's going to conclude this episode, folks. I appreciate each and every one of y'all for watching. Um, just showing love and support. And um, just being there. You know, I, I, I really thank y'all. Um, oh, I, I think I forgot the tags in the last episode or two. Uh, of New Woodshire, so here, I'm going to throw in two tags right now. Alright, folks, that's going to conclude everything. I, I'm needing a tractor for this wood chipper. We need to go down 18 and do that feel. So, yeah, and we got some plans for field 9 and 10 over. So, I guess I'll get this guy on it. Needs to be one with front loader arms. But anyway, like I said, I love each and every one of y'all. I really appreciate everything y'all doing. And folks, I will see y'all in the next episode, okay? So y'all have a great day, a blessed day. See you later. I better fill this guy up before we leave.